Moore, are you okay letting Mantis fight the church alone out there? She won't fight. She'll focus on evacuating people. Maybe they can all hide in the caves. So she's just gonna let the church take over her homeworld? Mantis would tell you that people matter more than the planet. And she knows that the church won't stop coming until we rescue Nikki. You have great confidence in this celestial Madonna. She's one of the few people I know I can trust. Really? She freaks me out. Because she's smarter than you? And kinder. Hey, that nickname makes my skin crawl. I'm furry, not fuzzy. Not even that little. Hey, Quill. You seem like you're in a good mood. Huh, do I? I've got a great idea for a new blaster extension. Can't wait to put it together. Well, now that the gang's back together and we've got a minute to breathe, I think you deserve an official thank you for what you did on Lamentis. <laughs> Quill, I, uh... I know you don't like that kind of sappy stuff, but I really mean it. Knowing about the crap those scientists did to you, not only does it make my blood boil, it puts everything into perspective. Oh, come on. It was just a puddle. I don't know if I could have gotten over something like that. You saved our lives, man. You deserve a bit of praise. The rodents saved your lives, and scientists were involved. I have many questions. Yeah, well, save them for the next time we all get a drink together, buddy. Did you just... You have closed the refrigerator door. Yeah, I do that sometimes. I thought I was the only one who ever bothered. I thought I was the only one. I observed the tree closing at once. Glad you're back on our side, Drax. I got a feeling we'll need to go full destroyer on this one. I shall be ready, Peter Quill. I have witnessed the threat posed by Magus firsthand. No one should suffer from its malignant lies. I owe all of you a great debt of gratitude. It would be my honor to fight beside you with all of my might. That's a lot of might. Groot agrees with you, Muscles. Sounds like we've got ourselves a nice church butt-kicking party. I only hope our guest agrees to join this buttock-striking celebration. What'll it be this time? Confetti jet boots? One shiny upgrade. Nice. Now that that's done, can we get a move on, Jelly Legs? Hey, Warlock. Open up. This is my room, you know. And that would be my cassette cover. You pen this pithy poetry? It's not poetry, it's music. Hard rock. It's supposed to have guitars and bass and drums. Simplistic scriptures, as is its scribe. Okay, what's your deal, man? What did I do to piss you off? Your lamentable leadership allowed the Madonna to leave when we needed her talents to travel to the telepathic realm. Mantis had good reason to stay behind. We just need to get Nikki and get the hell out so we can find her again. Your tenuous tactics trust too much to fortune. Can you confidently convince me your meager measures may amply manage this mission? My meager what? Your meager metal. We stand against an adversary unlike any before. Blinded by burning, hope-fueled hate. Magus, right, your evil twin. That's our adversary. Before such a blaze, still a stooge may steer. But your wide-eyed wonder is merely wit and moxie. You strut as an insecure cock, uncertain of his stature. Does that mean what I think it means? This audacity acts as stilts on sand as the tide thralls you in. Leading must be wrought off the fullness of your yearning yoke. Will it be so? Yes. Absolutely. Wise words. Sure and measured. 
but beheld by my bemused misgivings. Your demeanor differs distinctly in direction from my more willful ways. Maybe we can meet in the middle then. Yes. An oath! Will you own an oath to operate with greater aggression? To give gravitas to gravid seasons of your soul and struggle not to stand on destiny's icy flows? Sure, man. Whatever it takes. Then assert it. I swear I'll be a good leader. That I'll be decisive and, and uh, that I won't let Manus do whatever she wants. I stand partially reassured. What about you, Mr. Fancy Words? How do I know you won't see Raker and have a change of heart? Why would I weasel away? Didn't you used to be best buds with him? We were common company for a fleeting fallow, through which I witnessed the incommensurable extent of his sadness. He mourns his lost son. That's why he's doing all of this. The church, the matriarch? Because he wants to get his kid back. But that can't happen, right? Magus can't- No. Cannot. So? We can count on you? When you reunite with Raker, that man's gotta go down. Indubitably. So, how is he? Frustrating. It's like talking to Suzanne Harris at the summer dance all over again. Ain't that the Humi girl you tried to impress with your yo-yo skills? Yeah, and it went about as well as talking to Mr. Cape. What's a yo-yo? explains why we ain't been able to reach Cosmo. If you don't answer it, they'll vaporize us. I will handle this communication. All yours, buddy. Deceased wife and daughter are with me. To thank the matriarch for her gift. May <sighs> the promise be fulfilled. You are clear to land at the spaceport. Rally's regiments while we wait, whistling in the wings. Landing as fast as I can, go. What the flark? Great! Cocoon Boy thinks he's a butterfly now. He is a man of action. Let's just hope that he can keep the church busy while we look for Nikki. Didn't think you'd be able to bluff your way through security muscles. I am quite adept at deception. We're gonna need more than that to get to the Continuum Cortex and rescue Nikki. Especially with Golden Boy jumping ship. Should we, like, try to find him? Time is running out. We cannot lose focus if we are to save the girl. Drax is right. Let's just hope Warlock can do a bit of damage on his side. So, final showdown against Raker. This time, you'll get him for good. I intend to. We're not leaving here without Nikki. I am Groot. Groot wants you to know he'll do all he can to save your kid. You know what? I think I kind of understood that. Your kid sure got herself in a deep quill. Her mom died, man. If Warlock's telling the truth, that thing inside her is using Corel's death to manipulate her. I get it. Ain't gonna be easy getting her out of there, but I'll die trying. 
Ready, Drax? I am. My blades are as sharp as the rodent's tongue. Was that a metaphor? It was a simile. You take care of the Milano, okay? Make sure the ship's still here when we come back. Let's do this! Time to save Nikki. Peter? Okay. Just be cool. Let me handle these guys. Travelers, have you come to witness the fulfillment? The what now? The realization of the Matriarch's promise. The beginning of a new world. One without death, or pain, or fear. You should know this. Weren't you vetted and cleared to land here? What? Of course we were. How are you not aware of the fulfillment? Something is wrong. These heretics must be stopped! Attack! This spaceport. They have been very busy redecorating. All the more reason for us to get to the cortex and find Nikki. The promise is to be realized here. Converted will be flocking in to witness it. Are we the only new arrivals? We must be late.
Cosmos Towers shut down. That's because it's never been dark before. You do realize some of the guys shooting at us were nowhere security? This does not bode well for the dog. Never was the Mutt's biggest fan, but we could have used the backup telepath. This mission is about saving Nikki. It'll be a real shame if Cosmo bought into the promise, but like we said in Lamentis, if we cure her, we cure ev- Kinda dreading what we're gonna see in the marketplace. The same thing we saw when we flew in. Yeah, but it'll be up close. Boy, it really stunk sometimes, but- Clark! Over there! There's so many of them. I thought most nobodies would have rejected the promise. Everyone wants something they can't have. Yeah, but these crooks were suspicious of anyone giving them anything for free. Yeah, I don't know, Rocket. Like Gamora said, everybody wants something. The church tailors their offer to the individual. Seems to me most of them would give in. Or they'd be killed. Not an easy choice. They got Flark and Faith batteries everywhere. Just like Don Hal's Hope. Perhaps they have built another giant ray gun inside the Continuum Cortex. To sight and Faith from multiple worlds at once? Is that even possible? The energy ain't filling these batteries. It's moving away from them. So they're powering something. Sure looks like it. I'm surprised the church was able to seize the Cortex. It seemed pretty secure last time. Yeah, wasn't half as secure as the dog thought. The church's forces increased by the tick. Shh! Do not fear death. Don't mean we can't hurt him first. batteries the deeper we go. Hundred units says they're tied to the fulfillment. The priest said that they were bringing... They can't raise the dead, especially after we save Nikki. I wonder if any of these fortune tellers saw this coming. Unlikely. They were all charlatans. Most of them were pickpockets and fences. Pretty useful people to know. Contact here rotations ago. You did? Was it blurf? No, no, no. Shut up and puts, maybe? Whoa, 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 whoa. Cat free. Over here. Looks like we can squeeze through. We must be close to Mantlo's bar. Can you see it? Not really. There's a lot of debris in the way. There is no way through this wall. Could be a bunch of wackos just waiting for us on the other side. Good point. Peter, you should find a way over to check. What? Why me? Ain't you the leader of this outfit? Hmm. I bet I could pull that chunk out. Hey! Oh! Peter! Well, that didn't work. Clark, I'm going in. What about the fanatics? I'll toast them if I see them. We're the only ones that can do this, right? Clear back here, Quill. Looks like you're gonna have to yank a chunk free from this side, though. Gamora, you should be able to get your sword in there now. Give me a boost. Oh, Scott! Not Mantlos. Look at her. This is personal, Quill. Don't leave me hanging. I know how much you love this dive. It was the one spot in this whole Flarkin galaxy where a guy could feel safe. I mean, except for the bar brawls and the security raids and the bounty hunters. We'll drink to it later. Right now, we've got to keep moving. done here, we will need to tell a Rhapsodist about these adventures. A what? They are the keepers of Katathian lore. This will be an epic tale. Okay, okay. Gotta make a passage here. There's been no 
sign of gold boxes. Adam Warlock. Might be splattered somewhere across the lower city. Or got picked up by a wandering creep squad. Yeah, what do we need the Golden Boy for anyways? We were doing fine without him. I was not fine. Magus was devouring my soul. Your memory is suspect. My memory is flawless. I'm just an optimist. Ha! You know why we need Warlock to stop Magus' space magic ritual? We don't know space magic. Yeah, because that ain't a real thing. Sweet. Man, I'm not so sure anymore, not after Lamentis. None of this makes any sense, but Mantis gave us somebody who can fight it. Looks like the church is trying to keep us out of there. That's not gonna work. There is still no sign of the warlock. Based on when he jumped, he's probably already in the lower city. In a busted heat. Careful, Peter Quill. Guys, look down. It's an awful lot of light. You're thinking it's the full Flarkman, ain't you? But it could just be runoff from the cables. Whatever these whack jobs are up to, they need a lot of juice. Perhaps this is how they powered their fleet to reach Lamentus. Nah. Nikki had Warlock's Soul Stone in her hand. What if it's fused there and Raker's trying to remove it? <laughs> like you did with Goldilocks? Didn't work all that well the first time. The girl may have sensed the evil in the stone and insisted they try again. Or she's outlived her usefulness and Raker wants the stone's power for himself. Regardless, we must reach the Undercity to find the girl and stop whatever they are doing. And we'll have to be ready for them to try and stop us. The converted ones will be prepared to die in order to bring their loved ones back to life. Which is pretty ironic. Our level of cooperation is invigorating. We have become a formidable team. Yep, sure have, Drax. And we're just one big, happy Flark and family. What are you doing with that garbage? She's not garbage. Tracks. 
stop whatever that police was doing here! Make well! I'll be your wingman any time! I'll be your wingman any time! Our foes laugh as their shaman compels them! The priest is channeling power into that one! Post me next! Oh, you crash! Welcome, death! Definitely not good. Gamora, wait! Hold on a sec! Why? So more children can be sacrificed in the name of Rager's flogged up church? Of course not, just... Just what, Peter? I don't know. Breathe. Every minute we waste. We don't have time to breathe. I know Raker brings back bad memories. This isn't about Thanos! It's about Nikki. And what men like Raker and Thanos do to girls like her. Like me. My sister. If I had just been better at protecting Nebula, maybe... Maybe she wouldn't be dead. Whoa. What? Nebula's dead? How? By who? Tell me, so I can find him and shake his protecting hand. By me. You killed your sister? She is the one you saw in the Matriarch's Promise. That's how I knew it was a lie. The nebula I knew had been twisted into a hateful, vengeful monster thing. One who would never stop unless I stopped her. So I did. I just never expected to survive. Why didn't you say something? It's not exactly a conversation starter. Hi, I'm Gamora. I murdered my sister. Can we be friends? Of course we can't. How can you be friends with a monster? Why would you want that on your team? A team I actually... I kind of enjoyed being on, all things considered. Well, uh, I hate Nebula, so I actually would have... What? I'm just saying it don't change nothing. Actually, it changes everything. The most deadly woman in the galaxy just admitted... She loves us. <laughs> I did not. You did. You said you were in love with us right after the part about killing your sister. I said I enjoyed your company. That is the Katathian definition of love. Like. I I'll give you like. C can we just move on? Agreed. That's about all the love fest I can take. We accept you, Gamora Zenubri. Pretty sure we're married now. This is excruciating. All right, I'm pretty sure we've all caught our breath. What say we go stop a nut job cult leader? Yes.
This one mocks our every effort! Send it their way, Drax! they can bring in here. We gotta shut it down! Let's get to the bridge. Cosmos Tower is the quickest way. Too wide to cross. Maybe we can bridge the gap. We keep saying bridge, and it's starting to sound like a made-up word. All words are made up. You see that kid in the ritual thing? I could not miss him. You think the church did that to his head? It was before Sucker Born like that. Yeah, it's too big to jump. So, Gamora... How am I supposed to drop the most interesting thing she's ever done? You need to find a way to get us across. We should be prepared in case the Grand Unifier arrives. I'm more than ready. I could topple the pillar. Drax? I have been eager to topple something over. You know, I usually hated when that Cosmo spotlight would shine down on me. Really? A Fate Force field? If we can find the power source, we should be able to turn it off. Let's get looking, then. That's it, Peter! Let's go! We need to get out of here before Raker shows up. Alright, get ahead! Let's book it! I was not the target! <laughs> Guardians of the galaxy. The matriarch has chosen to enact the fulfillment from this station. And you shall not stop her. She hasn't chosen anything. You've been manipulating her from the start. She is the light. And I am merely her servant. Kinda hard to be the light with that dark monster thingy inside of her. Blasphemy! You may have rejected her. But you will believe when it returns you from death's cold clutches. Your pain has pushed you to a perilous precipice, old friend. You die. The form is fleeting, but the foundation remains forever. Now cease this stubborn senselessness before it reaps a ruinous reward. Ruinous.
finish this! Keep the herd coming! Running and driving on roof cars! This is kind of fun! If there weren't so many of them, I'd agree with you! Tie them down, crew! Bob's old prick ass Goldie survived that jump! Did you see Raker's face when he showed up? are relentless! Just once I'd like to cross this bridge without incident! You can thank Goldie for that! The warlock saved us from certain death! <laughs> ah, I ain't scared of Ranger and his little light go! Look out! This has got my name on it! Peter Quill, unleash me on the school! I can't slice and do the centurion from down here. Guys, huddle up. He's right. We're getting our butts kicked. They appear to be superior. We can't take this any longer, Peter. Guys, come on! 
These goos aren't gonna take us out. We're better than that. Farkin' right. So let's go out there and show these Farkers who we really are. Who's with me? Victory is ours! This is gonna be fun! Oh, yeah! Hold oh, fast! Gamora! One of you! Any last words? Branch out, crew! Time for the big record tracks! I will enjoy this! Deadliest woman in coming! We don't need Golden Boy's help. Is that why you shot him? <laughs> oh yeah, that was great. Right in the butt. Did you see the look on his face? It was all like, oh my goodness. Look out! Let's not act for problems. Yeah! Now it's Nova. Slice and dice! Stay away from the edges! I gotta get close to get over! Three shall not fail! We approach the dark's tower! Hold on, Nikki! We're coming! Well, I guess Goldie survived that jump! I swear, if Warlock kills Breaker before I get a chance! How many are there? It's like all of nowhere showed up. As long as we're here, they can't go through with the whatever they called it. The that was not the name. I like it better. Running and gunning. This is kind of fun. We will need tattoos to commemorate this moment. Finally, I think they're giving up. Just in time, because we're not getting back on that bridge. I know where we are. There's a road nearby that intersects the main bridge to Cosmos. Where? It should be, uh, right below us. Drax, buddy, let's make a hole. That's one way down. The best way. I am eager to pull that sorcerer's insides to the outside. <laughs> I don't need another round. Warlock can squeeze the life out of that freak for all I care. Anyone see a way across? I am Quill. Yeah, we can't do nothing with that sign in the way, Quill. Always knew nowhere would get raided, but not like this. Thought it would be the world mine dragon tunnel. Ba 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 boom, baby! You sure are destroying a lot of advertising today. Like we need another reminder to buy Calex cream. What's so special about Goldie anyway? I don't suppose Groot knows another side route. If I could just get to the other side, I could hack that thing and drop the bridge. If you can get to the other side, we can get to the other side, and it wouldn't matter. <sighs> Throw me. What? Throw me! Just get muscles to huck me across. Do you have any idea how far down it is if you miss? We ain't got time to argue. I'll make it. Leave this to me! Whoa! Glad that wasn't rocket. You are a valued member of this team. Not a tool to be thrown about. Worried about this ritual. And what's really gonna happen if we can't stop it? Ain't gonna be dead people coming back, holding hands and wagging tails, that's for sure. <laughs>
We don't have to worry about that because we will stop it. More specifically, I'm gonna make Raker eat my element guns. Perhaps shooting him would yield better results. And then we're gonna bring my daughter home and that's... That's what worries you. One problem at a time. How dumb are these Flartnards to even fall for this full Flarkman garbage? Magus demands adulation, trapping you with vile illusion while feeding on your soul. I felt it in my promise too. That endless hunger. Oh yeah. Hungry is an understatement. Holy faith! All that light isn't leading to the Cortex. It is the Cortex. How could that mutt let this happen? Looks like you'll get to ask him yourself. This isn't going to end well. Cosmo! We've got to get down there! Don't count him out just yet. I've seen him get out of worse scrapes. The beast is being exposed to the promise! No! Get away from my dog! Nobody kicks a dog on my watch! They trick us to talk with a big solution! Nice tracks! Cosmo! Talk to us here! The dog has lost in memories of the past! All your food! This is an historic battle! The last stand of nowhere! Something tells me we got more scraps ahead! them now. 
He's our friend. Yeah, so is Drax. And I ain't going inside this Fleabag's head. Maybe it doesn't have to come to that. Hey, buddy. Are you, uh... Take him out before it's too late. Wait! He's still in there. I can hear him. I hear only barking. Focus your mind. He's there. Uh, oh, fuck it. Just shoot the mutt! Easy, bud. Friends, remember? He's Peter Quinn. Cosmo knows never lie. Yeah, buddy. It's me. It's all of us. Where is Cosmo smell? Smell of nowhere. Where else would we be? Fur brain. His mind is adult. Or he is simply a dog. <sighs> He doesn't see us. He's still in the promise. Cosmo, where are you? What do you see? Blue sky and cars to chase. Cosmo is big. Duma, how you see? Home. He's talking about Earth. Smell of fresh grass. Feeling of dirt between paws. No psychic burden, just... Walkies for going, and the ball for fetching. If you missed your home planet, could you not simply return at any time? Not at time that matter. Same reason Katarvia not go home. Earth was great. Cats to chase, trees to be on. But the point is, I get it. We all get homesick. But you gotta bury that bone and move on. Pyotr Quill does not know. He's like fleas, biting and biting, no matter how much Cosmo scratch! Oh, you Terrans have a real thing for your home planet. What's one hunk of rock over another? He's not about rock. He's about what Cosmo had on rock. Foot of bed for sleeping, belly for rubbing, collar with name. You miss being someone's property? Cosmo not property. Belong to family. Then one day, family gone. Men in suits sent Cosmo into space. Cosmo searched many dog years for those he lost. But yet... You had owners. It sounds like they gave you up. Family would never turn back on Cosmo. But what about your puppies, Cosmo? They're your family. Cosmo Young are... They're here, man. And they're counting on you! For love? For protection? But humans call for Cosmo to heal. Must be loyal. Those pups actually need you. Be loyal to them. Don't abandon them in space the way you were. Cosmo would never! But you have! They're somewhere here on nowhere, maybe needing your help right now. Come on, Cosmo, you gotta know this doesn't smell right. Pyotr Quill is right. Cosmo human have no smell. They are wicked perversions. You must bite them with all your might. Be gone! Cosmo not fetch your lies. That's it, buddy. You tell him. Nowhere is Cosmo home be. His pups, his family. We protect it all costs! Sick him, boy! <sighs> Should we help him? I mean, we may need him. I am optimistic for the beast's recovery. Cosmo's got his mission. We've got ours. Let's get to the Cortex. You think he'll be okay? He's got a thick coat. All right, I still got access codes from when me and Groot were on vacation. You mean when you quit the team? Why do you always gotta be so... Flark! Attack and scratch snatchers! Gah! Cosmo changed the codes. I guess so. All right, people. Let's find another way through. Perhaps you entered the code incorrectly. I have made the same mistake. 
With those sausage fingers? Of course you have. These nimble digits don't make mistakes. I know it's slow going. Blame the Flarknards who wrecked everything. I am Groot. Groot's right. This is a really old mining settlement. Everything was nice and crumbly even before the church shot everything to hell. Drax, can you handle this? An intriguing texture. I fear I will regret this. Just don't start kicking up dust. 